<laughs> Today, now the presidential election, Nigeria has done interfered and polling units. May they cast their votes. May they elect the next president of this country. He gave one update with the very, very important, where everybody must know. That update is now part of our discussion today. So, there with me as I bring you the update. My name is EDS. I beg, help me subscribe to this channel. Thank you. Make we start with this video. I'm going to watch. Section 134, subsection 2B of the, of the current of the Constitution. It is to say, it to be fact that no presidential candidate can be declared a winner in this election without having 25 percent in the federal capital territory that is very important for the whole world to know that tomorrow's election wherever the, the, the to be finally declared apart from having 25 percent in 24 states of the federal republic of nigeria the federal capital territory is like a compulsory question you can answer all that question the federal capital territory without having 25 percent you go nowhere who you see for that video now former a uh, residential uh, electoral commissioner uh, uh, a state mike igini him talks uh, uh, the law uh, according to the law a candidate must pull 24 percent of the total vote cast in 24 states but you know india including the fct so if you like clear 24 percent I'll be 25 percent in 24 states you know clear 25 percent in fct abuja you cannot be declared the president of this country <laughs> in shokona people go to ask why it be like that why make i tell you now why me i think say it be like that abuja na center of unity all tribes religion ethnicity are all represented here christianity islam represented here 50 50. so if you cannot win in a place where the whole of nigeria is represented then you are not fit to be president of the federal republic of nigeria now waiting that law eh now waiting in me most of now don't they get a a a a fear about beavers see can we have a credible fair and the uh, and, and 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 a good election hey, make i put that that way <laughs> english is not finished from my mouth can we have a credible election with beavers <laughs> mike igini don't also help us answer this question i'm gonna watch this election is going to be a different one in the sense that the beavers contrary to what people hear is a great game changer there's no room anymore for sharing of unused ballot. Beavers and ended the fraudulent practice. The organized crime apuni unit of sharing unused ballot. No more unused ballot. The beavers have then thrown the principle of one person, one person, one vote. Number three, at the end of the poll, the image or the form EC8A will not be snapped with the beavers like a PDF. You cannot utter it. It will be uploaded live. It is expected by now, Dr. Abati, that all candidates, political party, have set up their situation room so that their party agent can commence immediately the process of sending to their respective situation room every result that have been uploaded and duplicate given to party remember 
this election, just as you do what you call a biomodal process of accreditation, you also do what you call a dual process of collision. What they will send and what is going to be manually because from EC8, a duplicate will be given for every party agent. In, in which case, the party are likely to even see the result of the election, Nigeria generally. You are going to see pulling unit by pulling unit result. There will be no tension at all. Mike say with Beavers, he don't have any problem at all. Say we no get problem. Say Beavers, now the technology to checkmate election rigging election my practice. Say Beavers, go help us make sure say nothing like overvoting. Say now Beavers, go give Nigerians the president of their choice. Say now Beavers, go make the will of the people in this election. Make it come to pass. Uh, when I go down here about uh, overvoting, make I clear on an now. Say Beavers, eh? Go make sure, see, the number of accredited voters go equal the number of vote cast. We have problem then, I say, number of accredited voters no come rhyme with the number of uh, vote cast. Now, if you say over or under voting, don't occur. <laughs> Either of the case. So Beavers go help checkmate these kind of things. So we're gonna say eh, our election, it don't this standard. Him also talk for that video, say they form EC8 uh, A I'll be waiting with it. That's for what they use they enter the election result. Say after the election, where they don't enter them manually, eh, Beavers go snap them, pew, send them to headquarters, I neck. On the enemy. So even as the election they conclude, result. You don't reach I neck uh, office. So how people want to take a uh, rig this election? According to Mike Igini. Him also talks say nothing like on use paper or use the uh, ballot paper. Say before people could just use uh, people could just the uh, uh, capitalize on a uh, ballot paper where people no use vote. They go use them the uh, 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 they do uh, election my practice. But say this time, beavers don't make I'm sure say it no go happen again. No. Because number of accredited voters must equal number of vote cast in order to mitigate against with it, over voting or under voting. Anyway, will be the case. <laughs> Some of you are going to ask this question now. Say, if that is the case, what can happen for Osho State where they cancel the election because of over voting? Uh -huh. That question, now better question. Make you hear Mike Igini answer that question. I'm going to watch. Attempts to want to discredit a major technology had failed woefully. Beavers have been used for over 105 elections. Nothing has happened. Whatever they say about Osho, I'm sure that by the time the Court of Appeals of the Supreme Court finally take a decision, that will be clear. So some of the views we have expressed with respect to that will be very clear. The Beavers, there is nothing anybody can do. Mike say he will not understand what happened for there. Eh, say eh, this eh, tribunal will give their judgment. Say, make we wait, make appeal as Supreme Court, give their own judgment. Say, all this, their uru, 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 uru way of giving judgment. Say, him not understand that. But say, one thing where him be sure of, now say, waiting happen for Osho State, na legit election, when a beavers carry out that election. And there is no magumago -mago anywhere. So, if tribunal, they come and they talk, say, over voting, eh, may them go prove them for appeal. And the Supreme Court, since the person will win that election, go go go, he don't carry the case, enter appeal. We be say you go see come, you go see from appeal, enter where Supreme Court. They will all know who be the final uh, winner of that election. Now so him take answer. Him. Then we call the here Kepu Kepu say some parties their logo no they represented for the ballot paper. Waiting the sub, eh? What happened? Say people don't buy from campaign, eh? Get the the confidence of Nigerians to vote for them. Only to come find out say logo, their logo, no day for ballot paper. Wait till Mike Iguini get to talk about this one. I'm gonna watch. Maybe it's a one-off thing. If it's a one-off thing, well, we take it that in any activity that involves human being, perfection can be out of it. But it's expected that that should not happen if that is the case immediately that should be escalated to the commission but in any case how were they as how were they able to see you know i mean i'm not going to doubt anybody right now because 
And I saw it from you to make it round. And I've asked with some people in the commission. I said they have not even seen the ballot. So I don't know. If for any reason they have seen the ballot and it's an issue where they seen where a stone seen coming should not blind the eye. It is for the commission to quickly, as much as possible, to, to ensure that that is done. Mike say, as we take care of him, now so him, take care of him. Him come call people for the office, for the headquarters, say, hey, see what we did here. Now true, I will not be true. They say they don't know. Say even them, they never see the ballot paper. So the person, where they raise this issue, say their logo, no deal. Now the governor, the person where they run for governorship, uh, this in election, on that Labour Party in Lagos State. Now when they bring up this issue, when they hear me. So, Mike Guinea now come the assay. How the person will bring up this issue? How him take see the ballot paper? Since people were there for head of himself, eh, who they work there, they never see the ballot paper. So, how him take no see their own logo? No deal, the ballot paper. I wonder. <laughs> Wait till everybody is supposed to know, say, now election period with this. So, issues go come from left, right, and center. But one thing they should be say, God go help us for this election. On oh, they hear me. Very soon, the election results go to enter. Eh, one after the other. Then, then and after then, we go know whether Nigerians, eh, the will of Nigerians actually prevailed in this election. Eh, that this period, after today, tomorrow, now, collection go start. We go know whether now Emil Lock can win. Or we go know whether now Mr. SPV win. Or we go know whether now the stingy man with no structure, now you win. Whoever win, we go take and say, now the will of the Nigerian but Igu Badu say we don't suffer all these things. Finish. At the end of the day, we still continued in our old ways. Igu Bad. Another eight years loading. Wait never shall be say whether not for good or not for bad. It depends on who wins this election. It don't finish from my mouth. Make it be like say we don't see today. I go see Ona later. <laughs> I beg. If you like this update, subscribe to my channel. I beg. I beg. Bika. Ejo. Da Allah. <laughs> subscribe.